single moms out there, I wanted to share something with you that I am so excited about and kind of shocked that I was able to do this. But my oven stopped working a few weeks ago and it would not heat up. So I was able to use the broiler and the stovetop, but if I wanted to bake anything, it just wouldn't heat up. And I looked inside and the big bottom coil just stayed black. It wasn't heating up. So I was like, oh my gosh, I cannot afford a new oven right now. I had just gotten all my Christmas bills and now I was going to have to pay for an oven? No. So I used YouTube and looked up and tried to figure out and diagnose. I have no background in this, by the way what in the world it could be, why it wasn't working. And it was kind of easy to diagnose that it needed the new kind of bottom coil to heat up the oven. And I was like, okay, well, a new oven would be hundreds of dollars, but a coil would only be $30. So I took the risk and I ordered my piece and it came in the mail and I just looked at that box for days because I was like, huh, maybe it was a week. Maybe it was a little longer. Anyway, it was just sitting there, this big box. And I'm like, how am I gonna actually do this? But not having an oven for a few weeks made it really frustrating and complicated and what we were doing for dinner and everyone was getting cranky. So I was like, all right, this weekend, I'm gonna do it. And YouTube is amazing because they will walk you through step-by-step step to show you what to do. And every video that I watched, I watched a lot, I wanted to get this right, said that it was really simple. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna try it. I'm like, if not, I could turn this piece, right, on Amazon, and then I'll just find a second hand stove. So I followed the steps. I basically had to unscrew the heating element, pull it out, put the new one in, do these little clips, and screw it into the oven and then I turned it on and I waited and the coils heated up and my oven is now fixed and I am blown away because that's not something I ever thought I would do but being a single mom and having absolutely no money to put towards a new oven sort of pushed me into giving this a try and I am so excited now I'm looking at my kitchen and I'm like, oh my gosh, I need a new sink. The bottom piece of the faucet just fell off. So whenever I do dishes, the water just spurts out and I hate it. And I'm thinking, I think I'm going to try to replace my faucet next. So I wanted to make this video just to put it out there that it's amazing what we can do that like we never even like maybe crossed our mind or thought that it was possible to do and these things some of them might be too hard and maybe you needed to leave it to the experts but it's worth a shot to just take a look and see is this something i can figure out is this something i could do myself and it was really it felt empowering and i bragged to my kids right away because they were at their dad's and i sent the picture of the red coil heating up and I'm like, this is crazy. And I'm so feeling kind of really good about it. And I wanted to put it out there just to have you guys like, just consider that there's things out there. Maybe it has to do with some basic maintenance on your car. Maybe it has to do with some things around the house. I don't know, but don't rule it out. Consider like, let me do some research and see, are the parts cheap enough? Does it seem easy enough? And give it a try because I'm so excited that, knock on wood, as long as this continues to work, which I think it will, I mean, that's hundreds of dollars that can go to my savings account, can go to things that the kids need, can go to other emergencies that are gonna come up that I don't know how to fix. Like my dishwasher that at this point is like stuck in the cabinetry and I don't even know how to get it out to try to fix it. I'm going to watch some more videos and YouTube videos and see if anybody's posted about that or what I would even have to do. I have no idea. The dishwasher is like installed within the cabinetry and it doesn't look like it comes out. 
but I would really like to have a, a dishwasher that works. So I'm going to do some research on that and maybe I can fix that too. So I'll keep you posted. But just wanted to tell you single moms, there's so much you can do more than you even imagined. And I hope that this video is helpful. And I know that any tip that can help you or encourage you to save some money is a good thing. See you next time. Bye.